Good morning. The thing that is on my mind this morning is my word of the year. So at the beginning of 2023, I didn't have my word of the year ready yet. I typically know a couple of weeks in advance what my word of the year is going to be. And I just, I didn't have any idea. New Year's Eve, when I went to sleep that night, I was thinking about how unusual that is for me. And in my dreams, I dreamt that my word of the year was believe. And when I woke up, it just gave me chills because that is the perfect word of the year for me. I am really learning to trust, to fall back and know that the right things are coming to me, to not get stressed when things don't go the way I had expected in my business and believe that it's all part of a bigger plan. I'm not a big fan of New Year's resolutions, so I don't ever create a New Year's resolution. I do love the word of the year and I also love goals. So I've done a different way of planning goals for 2023 that I'll share with you in next week's video. I am so connected to my word of the year and really just bringing in that abundance and the things that are meant for me by believing that everything is happening in my life for me. I would love to hear from you. What was your word of the year for 2023 and how is it manifesting in your life as we approach the second quarter of the year? So much abundance to be had knowing that the right things, the things that are meant for us are coming our way. This is how we rise.